Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, it is super early in the morning. It is 7.05. I threw on some clothes and we are going to check out Walmart. If I tend to go to Walmart, I like to go very early before it gets crowded. So we're gonna head there. I am still sitting in my garage, but we're gonna see what they have out for fall. <laughs> I'm not going to go through every single item. I'm just going to show you a lot of the items and then some of my favorite. I was so surprised at Walmart. They had some great items out and the prices you just can't beat. I love this cow. I just couldn't think of a place that I can use it in my home, but I loved it so much and it was only around five dollars it was so cute um they had this garland but i decided against it since i'm going to be making the garland for brooklyn's play area but they just had such cute items that you guys you can't beat the prices at walmart i was shocked my store didn't even have that many aisles that were open but they did have um they only had like two and a half and then a whole floral area so they didn't have much, but what they had, I was pleased with. new to my channel and this is the first video that you have found welcome my name is dream I am a mama of two I live in Southern California with my husband and my two children and I would love for you to join my little YouTube family I make videos that have to do with cleaning just homemaking in general so cleaning organizing and I love decorating my home and making it cozy for my little family. So if you love that type of content, don't hesitate to subscribe. Click that little subscribe button down below and I would love to have you part of my family. So what are you guys doing for fall? You guys know I always love to ask you a question during my videos. What colors are you going with? Are you doing the more traditional? Are you sticking with black and white? Are you doing neutrals? Let me know down in the comments below what kind of colors you are going with. Um, there are, I feel like in the stores this time, you can run the gamut. So they have a little bit of everything. I will say that, um, Walmart was a little bit more traditional, but Hobby Lobby, Michaels, they all have a little bit of everything. So I want to know what you guys are going with, what kind of colorway that you are going to decorate for this fall.
With decor, my philosophy, I don't know if I really follow trends kind of ever. <laughs> Um, maybe a little bit. I don't know. I just stick with what I like. And you guys are going to see that in my fall videos that will be out very soon. I'm going to have a lot of um, clean and decorate with me. And then the big finale will be my fall house tour. I do these every year for all of the major holidays. But um, I just stick with what I like. And I say that for everybody. And you do not have to go out and spend a ton of money on decor. I like to show you guys a whole array of different decor. I did Dollar Tree, I did Hobby Lobby, I've gone to Walmart. I am going to be using some items that I have and repainting them. I actually, I did a haul where I showed you all of my old items. So use what you have. Um, don't think that you have to go out and spend a ton of money, especially during this time where a lot of people are still out of work and spend a ton of money on fall decor. Use items that you have, supplement with things that you can find at the Dollar Tree. I'm gonna have a few DIY projects coming up with Dollar Tree items and you can make your home a home. A home is a home with the people that live in it. It doesn't matter about the stuff. Stuff is just stuff. I like to make these videos because I know they make me happy and I know they make other people happy. Who doesn't love decorating and having uh, your home be cozy for the holidays? But don't think that you have to go out and spend a ton of money. Use what you have and just make it work. low price and a lot of these you can transform with dollar paint. I got my paint also at Walmart and it was very cheap. Do you guys see the, I love these flat ones for the stacking and they, you can paint those so easily um, because of their foam and porous material. You can paint those really easy to go along with whatever color scheme that you are doing in your home. And a little bit of chalk paint goes a long way. Um, Walmart also has the best deal on signs like these signs are dollar two dollars they are so affordable and so inexpensive and in a lot of these if you don't like the way they are DIY them repaint them um, add your own touch to them I just think that um, I just love their prices and I just love that I can get a sign for two dollars and if I like it I like it if I don't I can spend another use paint that I have at home and transform it into something that I do like but um, their signs are such a great price and I thought this one was a good one for Thanksgiving time but those stacking pumpkins I may have to go back because even with all three of them maybe you're gonna play $17 but to buy pumpkins stacked up, you're gonna pay well over 20, 30, 40 dollars. Like you're not gonna find that cheap price. And with a little paint, you could make it go with any color scheme. And all of their little bundles, four dollars for all of these. I didn't pick this one up because it has pears in it and I don't really use those to decorate, but I did pick up two of the smaller ones and they were two dollars dollars for all of those small pumpkins half of the bag I'm gonna leave white the other ones I am going to paint an orange color and they're gonna be perfect
I'm back. I was going to do a quick haul. This is not the prettiest. I am in the garage, but I got two bags of these. They were only $2.98. One of these I'm going to paint completely orange. Um, I'll go grab the paint in a second. And I got this sign. I thought this was sign was so cute. It's real enamel and it's just really, really cute. And this is kind of a sign you can have up all year round if you have farmhouse decor. And this was only $6.98. You can't beat those Walmart prices. And then it has like a little twine. I got two of these baskets, which of course I will have overflowing with pumpkins. They had three sizes, but I got the two smallest ones. So this one for $4.98, it's the tinier one. And then this one for $5.98, so cute. Lots and lots of floral stems. Um, lamb's ear, which I always get, I'm obsessed. I think I'm gonna use this on my tablescape. Um, these little bundles were $3 a piece and I picked up four of them. So cute. This little foam pumpkin for $2.98 and I'm going to paint it an orange color. I'll show you guys. Another one, I'm gonna also paint this one an orange color like it's chipped a little bit, but I didn't care since I was going to paint it. These cute little signs where you can use anywhere. So hello fall. They were only $1.47. So cute. This one, thankful. $1.47. And then this one, which I thought was really cute. It says, welcome. And um, they're all rusted out. And this one was only $5.97. And I think I may use this inside my reef on my front door. Like the reef that I currently have up that's from um, Hearth and Hand Collection. So it's like a plain one, but I think I may use that. And then tons of florals I picked up. I really love these, so pretty. So you guys can kind of see the colorway that I'm going with. So still my neutrals, I was gonna try to switch. I think you should just do what you love. And this is what I love, so I'm gonna stick with that. These picks right here were like, these ones were only 97 cents. These ones were 329 and then these ones were 329. So like I said, stick with what you love. And this is what I love. I love this color tone, so that's what I'm gonna stick with. And then I picked up these two. Hopefully I can combine them in this chalk paint from Walmart and make a pretty orange color that I love. But yes, and um, that is all that I picked up for fall. And I am so excited. Walmart had such great prices um, and some great fall items out.